not hearing its soundtrack. And uh, let's switch to. Hello? Yeah, there we go. I hope this is not too loud. What? Let me just make sure that it's not cranked up all the way. The audience is now deaf. Okay. So that's plot. Um. So you know this is. I forgot his name was up. Guarded by an army of fierce warriors stands the fortress of the evil warlord, Akuma. Deep in the darkest dungeon of the castle, Akuma gloats over his lovely captive, the Princess Mariko. You are one trained in the way of karate, a karate ka. Alone and unarmed, you must defeat Akuma and rescue the beautiful Mariko. Put fear and self-concern behind you. Focus your will on your objective, accepting death as a possibility. This is the way of the karate ka. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, do I? Oh, is the sound not working? There might not be sound on the computer. Uh, oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, it was it was stalling for some reason. Um, let me see. Now the, the, the funny thing is that this emulator, this emulator reproduces oh, the hard the, 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 the disc right sound. Oh, does horns. it? <laughs> yes. It has horns and an angry face. Hey, how you doing? Now I think... Oh. Let me see... Oh my god! Most fascinating Codblops story. It done. actually oh. looks like me too. Okay, yeah. alright. So, so we're, we're in the game right now, actually. You play as Anderson Cooper, <laughs> well, Master of Karate. Actually, if you see the box art for the Brotherbun 1984 version, the uh, protagonist is blonde and kind of has this... Uh, I, I I'm thinking Richard Dean Anderson, but you know, <laughs> <laughs> um, that's probably but but you know it was more appropriate for His the name 80s. Is Biff. Um, and uh, I, 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 actually, let me see if I can if I can swap out of here without mm. losing the game. Let me see. Karateka cover. Oops, ah, crap! Mm. I don't want you to look at my mail. Found it. Uh, uh, box art. Uh, there we go. Oh wow. <laughs> Yes, oh, the yeah. 80s. Okay, yeah. Yeah. this is basically a of Jim Kata, which is a thing you need to look up on YouTube. Right? Jim Kata is pretty awesome. Um, We've all seen I it, right? I love the guy wearing his gi and also a samurai <laughs> helmet. That's pretty sweet. Yeah, well, and it's actually kind of accurate to the game. Um, the castle in the box art doesn't have horns, but, you know, it's, it's, it's kind of... And Princess Mariko is also blonde um, and missing an eye. Um, so <laughs> but, I knew um, this had a link to Kill Bill. I knew it. So this is a this is an Apple II game. I'm going to bring it up to full screen. Um, um, uh, Nick Monfort actually had volunteered his Apple II C, but the disc uh, that he had uh, was a little flaky. Um, the there is an Easter egg apparently in the original release it's where nice. if you flip the disc the other side, there will be um, a version of the game. Where all the graphics ran upside down, uh, <laughs> but about only in the like the initial uh, in the initial run of, uh, of of copies. And so, if somebody called tech support and said, "Oh my, all all the graphics are coming up upside down," they'll tell you to flip the disc over. <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty cool. So, um, Karataka uh, is I, I, that's how I'm pronouncing it. That's probably a million ways to, different ways to pronounce it. But um, tweet. Um, uh, basically, a solo effort uh, of, um, with Jordan Mechner programming for two years in his Yale dorm room, um, apparently. And uh, he credits his dad for doing the music, uh, or at least composing the music. I'm sure uh, Jordan Mechner did the coding. Um, but uh, I think that's his uh, his gym instructor, or his, or, or, or his karate instructor, that he's rotoscoping. Uh, for this game. So if you notice from the animation, you try not to stand in the way of the camera. All this is sort of like hand-drawn from uh, a Super 8 film, frames of Super 8 film that he shot and then he will, you know, isolate and then and then uh, uh, redraw in four colors, which is what you could get on the Apple II at a time. Um, I mean, it's pretty amazing. You've got something that's kind of like parallax, I guess. Oops. Uh, you got your health bar at the bottom, 
basic controls uh you got space bar to change your stance this allows you to run don't ever do that <laughs> yeah. uh, oh. Oh, oh well that was close Oof. yeah um if, if somebody hits you while you are running you die um you have high low punches this is a mid punch this is a low punch a high kick a middle kick and, and a low kick and this is kind of the tutorial guy so you keep regaining your health at this point for so to say he also has horns by the way in case you're wondering why this is a good guy or a bad guy and his face is blue and his hands are blue his hands are blue i think his i think that's actually his face right right there oh, okay. i think i think he's a horned guy there's room there just around the chairs Hello. Hello. Hey. Let's see. The seat is available actually because I'm going to make someone play this game uh, 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 as soon as, uh, <laughs> as somebody wants to give it a shot. You can't make this game. I think Owen gets a pass because of his amazing narration. Now, it, 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 you, you, if you walk, you know, you, you have this little um, side, nice little sidestep animation, or you can do this like full, uh, this this half shimmy. But he can actually push you off the cliff. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Does and he bow? Does he bow? I love how it didn't kill you until a little while after, so you right. <laughs> right. Yeah. And then you hear the sound effect of the thud. Now, if you notice the game, if you notice the game says the end, not game over. And this was actually uh, something that Jordan Mechner, I believe, credits Choplifter, uh, yeah. which was a game that inspired him to to make this particular game. This was not his first game. Uh, he had a couple of games prior to, to this. Choplifter also ends with a the end, uh, and kind of prior to that. Um, and he has a book um, where he recounts the development process leading up to Prince of Persia, but then of course he recounts a lot of stuff that he that went into Karateka as well. Um, Prince of Persia came after Karateka, uh, but uh, he talks about how before Choplifter he hadn't really thought about games as having the sort of beginning, middle, and end. He always kind of thought of them as this like endless loop that you just keep on grinding through. Um, so uh so so this was this was his attempt to basically try to make a cinematic or at least a storytelling type game uh and you have these scenes setting up the damsel damsel in distress uh uh uh, uh scenario um, I can imagine that's just how they communicated in feudal Japan mm -hmm. <laughs> was with those That's like, how I walk around the house. <laughs> I mean, I mean w w w with massive shoulder pads. I mean, I, I kill for shoulder pads. Though, I think. If you were jumping on the walk in this dress, you guys, it's really clingy. <laughs> but no, I fell over. Wow. I wonder if that one's rotoscope as well. Probably is. Okay, for a second there, I thought that was going into, like, Charge of the Light Brigade. Mm-hmm. And, uh... Punch. Oh, so this is actually just a replay of what I just did. No, it's just a I think this is a track mode, yeah. No? Okay. He's doing better than you did. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, yes. Well, okay. for starters, he hasn't been forced off a cliff, so... Well, the, I did get forced off a cliff until much later. Anyway, so what? Someone like to try to play the game? Oh, Got enough of that in the 80s, thanks. Todd, you're up. You took the box thing as a kid. <laughs> I did enough of this back in the actual 1980s. I don't want to do it now. I'm more of a Prince of Persia sword fighting kind of guy. Yeah, right. It's, I don't know, if, if, if you're into Prince of Persia, you'll probably get into this. The only, the only thing about this game is that um, for a fighting game, there's no block. Uh, there's just space. Uh, it, it, it's all about, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so space bar changes your stance. <laughs> Um, arrow keys move you forward and back. You probably don't want to go back at this point. Right. Um, <laughs> and then there's the six Where keys. did I park? Yep. Oh god! Q A. Yeah, Q A Z W S X and B for bow, which you can only do from a standing <laughs> stance. That's great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome. They never bow back. Yeah.
Yeah, I know. Yeah, it's, the the frame rate. <laughs> it's about eight frames per second, uh, or I mean, on a at its best, it's about eight frames per second. Apparently, once you start seeing gates in in, in the frame, the frame rate drops. Yeah, but yeah, but. There's punching. I'm just. I never liked punching because it's short range. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It is. To it is one. A, a punch is one frame, whereas a a. Oh wow! There was a block there actually. So I think if down. if you both hit the same. The same height, you can block it. <laughs> like twenty minutes later, <laughs> like he puts his foot in your midsection. You're like, there ow! So. I like the. Yeah, you this 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 kind of like a uh, cross crossing in front and behind. <laughs> I've lately been on this kick of reimagining every action game I play as starring Pam Greer, like black exploitation Pam Greer. And I'm thinking this like would, be, yeah. would be pretty <laughs> awesome with Kung Fu Pam Greer. So to that's, make Afro whoa. puffs kicking Why the did platforms. He, like, point at you and turn you away? So there was a there was a cutscene there where the the bad guys, the, the the bad chief sends out his uh, where Akuma sends out his henchman, and then and then there's this inner cutting between you and you have control when you see you, and this guy who's racing out to huh. to welcome you with tea. I'm sure. Yeah. <laughs> Would you like to come to the business center? <laughs> no. You have a phone call. Uh, yeah. Bow bow. He's mad because his stormtrooper helmet won't let him see anything. <laughs> yes, this is my strategy. I kick Just him in the face. Just keep him in the face <laughs> This is why I never won the game. Eventually, you need to do better than this. I don't understand how you could do better than this. <laughs> Dance battle. That's what you did. I like how sometimes he just like ends up smoothing out his hair. Man, I want to make a version of this where you like you do randomly oh. do. Uh, you a bow. Oh, there is a bow, bow button B. <laughs> it is um, it's a nice little touch for for the for the aesthetic of this game, I think. I always imagined when I was playing that when the guys run towards me, I should run towards him because otherwise they just keep sending more guys. Yeah. <laughs> no, there is a part of the game that actually that, where that is true. Actually, oh. where you yeah, want to cover as much ground as possible, otherwise you. Uh, That's when you really discover how painful it is to be not in fighting stance to meet somebody. Yeah. <laughs> if somebody kicks you while you're in running stance, uh, you will just die. Running is hard. Pow. Wow, so it's just like infinite dudes. It's not infinite. There's a storyline. Or at least <laughs> a sequence. <laughs> He's got oh, more he hits. has way more health. Yeah. yeah. So, so do they have as much health as you like, lose? Like, if, if you... the that's the end of a battle to be in the... Right, so now he's actually skillful. Damn it. Oh, I see. So it's like a stamina that has regen. I think the regen... Does the regen only happen when you're outdoors? I don't recall. Yeah. I think at some point you do end is up he, wanting not to get Is there. he solar powered? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was I guess that's just... that's what that hair's all about. I thought it was just the beginning of the game that did that. But... Um, I, but yeah, I haven't gotten very far in the game, to be perfectly honest. Yeah, he's regenerating a little bit, so it's still working. Yeah. It's <laughs> <laughs> <That's> relatively... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! Uh -oh. Yeah, that you know what, Joe? Like, that would have been kicks. a pretty awesome two or three seconds of Jackie Chan with the footage. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, oh no! Bow, damn it! <laughs> oh, you're not bow because you're evil. You're evil. Yeah. yeah. That's how you know he's evil. Asshat. Oh, Thank you. So, hmm? I can, I can, here, I can, I can so is before. there a strategy to the game? <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's. It's how do you play well? It's a fighting game. You how do you play a fighting game well? You get mash so buttons. Mash <laughs> buttons are the best. No, um, but can you block? There's no, no block, but they're they do. Um, like his his moves are not instant. Yeah. And they, I don't know if there's a sequence, but there may be some kind of sequencing that you can think about. And 
Plus, yeah. it seems like same, same attack type, same yeah. timing, height, yeah. bounced off. Right. There's, There's also same range. Straight like, punch and You can punch. probably close and like punch him a lot while he's trying to kick you, mm -hmm. and then move out. Yep. Hmm. It also is kind of a little bit faithful to the the animation in a sense that when you're when someone's kicking low and you're kicking high, they don't hit you because your foot isn't there. Yeah, the collision texture actually in this game is amazing. I mean, it's it, it's probably more kludgy in behind the scenes, but you know it looks great. It could just be we, we test the pixel and see. It could be. Is, is the pixel light? Oh, mm -hmm. yeah. But you saw some of what the game was doing with the intercutting between different camera angles and you know Don't the little nods to the storyline that they've got. Those and of course, all that gets expanded on uh, with Prince of Persia, which comes a couple of years I later. Think I think like five, no, five years later, something. Like that. Yeah. You get to like the hard. Oh, you get well if you get far enough. Yes, yes. you know. So so. Um, that hawk on the guy's shoulder eventually attacks you, um, and actually I'm going to, uh, <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's fast, it's, yeah, it's I'm fast gonna... and you have to do stuff like high kick it, okay. <laughs> but of course high kick has a really low start time, so it's the time it's right. see whether, um, I'm going to see whether I can bring up the, uh, let's see, karate uh, speedrun? Well, I'm trying to find the ad. For, uh, here's the official. Ooh. Yeah, you absolutely have to play that. <laughs> oh, is this going to be an ad? It's going to be an ad. Yeah. Sorry about yeah, the violence. But this is for the app. This is for the new. Oh, one. this is it. This is it. <laughs> the legend begins long ago. <laughs> <laughs> a simpler time. The evil warlord Akuma. <laughs> The princess Mariko, holding her captive in his fortress. From this despair, a hero was born. <laughs> a karate castle. <laughs> I was his sensei. <laughs> okay. <You know. laughs> Always punch the hawk! <laughs> <laughs> Akuma defeated, our land was safe once more. I can fish, I can read, I have time for gardening, I wrote a play. <laughs> now, the darkness has returned. Akuma has captured our princess again. One has been stood. Three are now forged in his spirit. True love. His passion is his strength. Good. Monk, he is righteous and determined. Always punch the hawk. <laughs> very, very large. Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> One of these heroes must save the princess. Oh, she's brilliant. Only you <laughs> can guide them. <laughs> Modern Fuka. This is the way. Karate. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Right. All right. So you know that's that's uh, now I'm gonna have to switch cables around a little bit. Uh, totally yeah. submitting that for the TEDs. Oh yeah, they're yeah. ad ads. That's ads an idea that like. worth spreading. Yeah. <laughs> that's the Punch the hawk is an idea worth spreading. <laughs> <laughs> Hawks attacking you! That's Don't run away! Punch the hawk! I think we're halfway to a self-help title. <laughs> right, so I've got to find a place. Uh, Learning to punch the hawk. Okay. Uh, so this is a little bit different uh, in terms of game mechanics. It, there, this game, this version of the game is almost 50% uh, blocking, uh, and 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 most battles begin with a block. Uh, you, you you have to invite the enemy to attack you, block that, and then strike back. Um, that's got more than four colors, as I mentioned earlier. Uh, <laughs> 
the music uh, in this game is done by Christopher Tin, who also won the Grammy for uh, the title song for Civilization Four, Baba Yetu. Uh, and one of the things that Jordan Mechner um, has talked about in why he wanted to do this remake, because not only had Skrantica never had a real sequel, they had a lot of ports, but 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 no sequel. Right? It took like 27 years. Um, Music was one of the things that he very much uh, talks about in interviews about something that he really felt felt that he couldn't uh, do what he wanted with Apple II. You know, the graphics and everything. You know, he notes that you know, yeah, you know, it was, it's great that a eight frames per second game could could be uh, acclaim could have won acclaimed uh, c cinematic accolades for for his time. Um, <laughs> But uh, if you you know you've already seen a little bit of the graphics, they're not photorealistic. They're not intended to be. They're meant to be this sort of like uh, woodblock style characters with a little bit of uh, Pixar style uh, or maybe Valve style um, stylization in, in there as well. Um, so um, much like the original game, the first couple of enemies are pretty much set up to help you learn how the game mechanics work. So I don't really think I need to explain the game, I'd, I'd like to invite someone to try the game. Uh, I just want to point out that it doesn't really matter where on the screen you tap, it's just one big button. Uh, it's almost a one button game, except for bowing, which requires two fingers. <laughs> yeah. um, I'll, I'll try. Yeah, give it a shot. But, um, uh, this is this game's available on um, just about every digital download platform except for um, Android. Uh, it's but you can get it on Steam or PC um, and PS3 oh. and Xbox as well. Did I mess something up? There it is. There it is. I was really hoping when I saw Philip playing this earlier that this game was about her taking her way yeah. out of here. Yeah. Oh, come on. I wish. You know better than I that. I had hopes! I had hopes! No, no, instead of one man, you get to play as three men. That's definitely like... And at least one of them may not be in the name Mary Bird at the end. You know, so you know. Well, the monk. Precisely. Probably. Yeah. That was, that was, that was Two nice. men and a unit. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> The scoring does lead into um, I mean, of course like one reason why the scoring exists is because of like game center, right? You know, uh, the fact that you can you you, you can post your your, your score up, up on leaderboards if you have the flower power. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I know. Yeah, this is, I'm, I'm pretty much just <laughs> tapping a bunch. It's like, oh, I, I, I blocked you, now I'm going to tap a whole bunch. That's why we punched the hawk. Why? Why did we punch the hawk? It's the bad guy's hawk. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Who's on the shoulder? No, you just hit birds. I've done that in other games. That's true. Man, Castlevania, those birds are there to knock you off things. You were there. So is the gameplay just really tap to block and then tap to attack? Yeah, tap that, I'm just attack. tapping a whole bunch after I block. Okay. Oh, okay, multiple attacks now. Yeah. On the upper side, there's a timer. Oh, yeah, the little blue thing. Yes. Yeah. And Philip was playing a blindfold, but it was pretty fun. Yeah, uh, he, he, eventually you realize this is, this is basically an audio game. Uh, uh, if you listen to the music, actually, you know, more than just the music being Tap atmospheric, the, the music is actually a gameplay cue. Genius. Genius. 
Yeah, yeah. Very dangerous, awesome attack. Punch in the head, I guess. <laughs> I trained for years to do this. Pow! Oh, he punched the hog! That was the most fascinating block I've ever seen. Also, who punches the It's all drunk and happy. Yeah. We were having a real nerd out moment before where I was like, that's actually Chinese Kenpo. That's not karate at all. <laughs> True love bonus. True love bonus. True love bonus. Uh, yeah. So yeah, this is basically a rhythm game. Yep. Yep. See, so why can't we have some dance battles? I think we totally could have, but it would be like uh But then you had the challenge of whether it would be a Japanese dance or uh, Oh, other Pan Asian dance. I didn't use my chi during that battle because I wanted to save it, but then it just used it up for me at the end anyway. Uh, I think we did it. I'm, 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 I'm only. I'm, I'm not tapping anywhere near it. Yeah, I think I think that might have just been uh, uh, a, a bad sensor. Kidding. No, oh, this is like infinitely infinity blade style, like. Break the fight, have someone be like, uh, 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 Part uh, of Infinity Blade, by the way. Uh, Jeremiah is going to be Infinity Blade. Punch out the sword. I love it. I mean, they are trying to emphasize character development. Uh, it's not character development, but it's character development. And, 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 you don't, and you do, in fact, meet people um, that really look like they're not there just to kick your ass, they're just there to do a job. <laughs> but uh, now they're going to kick your ass. <laughs> You're missing all. Oh, no. yeah. Do you actually do you actually pick up the flower? No, no, no it, it just it, you just you just tap on it and it absorbs. No, no, no. They smell oh, really nice. It's not as cool. It's not as cool as picking up the flower. Oh, what's oh, that? <laughs> Stun of Charizard. <laughs> Bogus that it doesn't, even though it's shaped like arrows, it doesn't remove a full arrow every time. It yeah, removes yeah. these weird little percentages. Yeah, that's true, that's true. So it's just a meter that's shaped like something else. It's weird because you can actually see points on the arrow. Uh, but you're right, it's basically a meter. It's, it is a more elaborate it's a, meter. It's yeah. an arrow shaped meter. Yeah. Like you already have discretionary units at that point. You yeah. remove a single you unit. You should try bowing sometimes. Oh, yeah, I don't know how to do that. It's just two pictures. Alright. But you can't do it when you're fighting stance. Yeah. I've never been in a fighting areas. Nope. Yeah. <laughs> he will tap in perfect rhythm and I won't seriously follow it. Heart attack! Defend yourself! Block the oh, attack! Block. Oh! Well, the, the, the block is itself a punch, so... Oh, that's a good point. I guess you're punching your head by either way. Ah! <laughs> Damn hawks. Oh, it's killing you, too. Hawks. 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 But, oh, like, it's but if you had caught it there, would it have like it's guy who died? Or no, would it have just come back? You could die from hawk attack. It is a you must fight it three times right, in the game, and at the end you kill it. Hawk. 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 Last block in, you, you'll get a chance to. Ah, I'm not doing that. Wow. <laughs> Sucker. I love how lazy that was, just like. <laughs> yeah. Boot! That's pretty. Breathe deep flower. I like that they've chosen trees that work well with polygons. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
I wonder if the game does look like uh, more graphically intense on the PC. I imagine that it probably does. But... I'm wondering how the gameplay transitions. I know, do you just click your mouse? It's mouse, no mouse. So it's just click, 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 click. Left, yeah, left, right, left, obviously. It varies apparently a right click. Look at this guy, his nose. He seems angry. He looks like a criminal. He does. He does. Yeah, that, that is a five man five man. That's it. And your face. Yes, buddy boy. Close it out. That's <laughs> that's just yeah, completely unnecessary. Yeah. <laughs> They just put that in, huh? I like that. It's it's it's. Uh, occasionally, some of them will bow back. Yeah. Uh, and uh, <laughs> if you're playing the monk, and later on you meet, the, there is another monk that you meet later, and that, <laughs> that fight is very. Oh, he's look at every time I do the bow, he does his little. Yeah. Sure. Come get some. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> it's Pavlov's ninja. Okay. <laughs> you asked for bowing, so you know. Damn, Damn there he is. <laughs> I bowed a lot. That's what happened. <laughs> the power of respect. Bowing, bowing you up. Good sportsmanship yeah. rules. <laughs> See, you didn't bow. Oh. Wow. Just all the hits. Yep, that's the, my strategy. I'm like Muhammad Ali, I'm just going to make him get tired first. <laughs> You're uh, rope-a-doping. Yeah. <laughs> How come it won't let you hit a bunch of times like you got hit that one time? I don't understand the mechanics for this game very well. There's clearly something a little deeper than what rushed the surface, but I'm not quite sure they're, they're really like telegraphing that to the player at all. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yay. <laughs> you punched a bird. Yeah, take that. I hate birds. Well, two I, know. I, know. <laughs> I can't tell the bad guy, the big bad guy of her. So is this the big bad guy? No. The big bad guy. He's got a big, like, happy coat on and stuff. But, like, surely, there's, surely there are many more. More bowing. I'm not gonna lie, this, <laughs> this guy's the color of his armor and the way that he held himself in that little cutscene totally said like the Don Flamenco in this game to me. <laughs> <laughs> Let us do battle with the Kung Fu. Oh. Oh, oh. I just want this all to be set to some cash out. Well, everything. I'd love to see the hawk with like a little black eye or something. <laughs> <laughs> that was a boss. It's holding a little True love bonus. to its head. Yeah. Okay, see, what I now want to see what the bonuses the other dudes get. I mean, what does what, 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 bonuses? What does the big bulky, what does the, what does the super big guy get? Sorry, that guy what bonus. What does the monk guy get? <laughs> Only unit bonus? Yeah. Yes. A unit bonus. <laughs> Five punches and a hundred and forty. That's first. Yeah, I'll get through. Yeah, I'll get through. Yeah, the big guy just loves punching. Yeah, this guy it was just like this guy's passion. Yeah, this is passion, dude. Yeah. Yeah. passion. But it's kind of janky. Definitely, like I definitely did not right. press the chi button for that. We were just I love him. Yeah, that might be the guy's head. Like, tell that he's voiced by Yuri Lowenthal. Did you see the art director? 
figure. Maybe you should go. Yeah. <laughs> Oof. Oof. Okay. He's like, wait. He's like, please stop experimenting on the end. Hey, no, hey, no, Ah, it's perfect. <laughs> he beckons and you're like, ah. Ow. <laughs> no, I'm afraid of kung fu. Stop. And you can't hit him after you. Um, you can hit him after he does this. Uh, oh. Yes. oh, Darius! Whoa, that was some <laughs> yellow water. He fell into cold water. Yeah, that's <laughs> that's not cool. Is that like that island from Voyage of the Dawn Treader where you just put stuff in the pool and turn it into gold? <laughs> you just tap it. Yep. Memory. Okay. Wait. There it goes. I didn't refill you all the way. Yeah, apparently he's inured to her love. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having fun, it's a game. Uh, good. Good. Oh, come on. Oh, you're sucking. I'm trying to hit the chi button. <laughs> yeah, not fully. It's not glowing. Oh. So that would be why. 20 minutes later. <laughs> I will punch you. There we go. Oh, you won't. Oh. <laughs> Not the bee. Oh. 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 And now you get to be the monk. Oh, and so now the monk gets. Oh, the monk was had a secret crush on her. I don't. Well, that's right. He does have muscles, so he must also have her. Actually, that's the rules. <laughs> <laughs> that totally looks like evil monk. I want you to know that totally looks like a monk. Yeah. This is so evil monk. So now you just start falling down. No. Did they just throw that guy's body off that cliff? Yeah. Well, they were done with him. So they're your extra lives. They're your extra lives. Each life, uh, 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 and they'll play differently. Um, so you get to pick them. No. You don't. You, yeah. You don't get to pick them. Well, true love has failed. Yeah. Next. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. That means that the giant, like, clearly not that intelligent ox guy is the the I mean, final resort. Yes. yes. You notice this guy has more hit points. Yes. Oh, so he's easy mode, this is medium, and the first guy's hard, basically. Right, yeah. okay. So the game is sort of still adjusting. That actually is I like that. If it's like, because if you wipe out real early on with that guy, it's like, look, well, here's nothing else. Oh, uh -oh. Attack. Punch it. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> so I'm just imagining the hot dog like, way going, God! Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> Get together, Darius. Kung Fu. There is a bit of regeneration. Yes. Yeah, he is regenerating. That's, that's true. Punch him! Was the previous card? No, the previous card was definitely not regenerated. Nice. Monks have regen. It's a video game. That's how it works. That's it. <laughs> You're like, let's leave the monk. <laughs> In the power suit. Mm -hmm. With some slender ankles. What is this? Yeah. And yeah, and you do not get any of those true love Tap twice to roll into a ball. Yeah. You do get two. monk bonus. You do? I didn't see the monk bonus. Well, you only get that and then you be the boss. Uh, the true love bonus only shows This got fast paced all of a sudden. And just for a minute. <laughs> okay, isn't Ow. that like Green Lantern's villain from Friends? <laughs> Is he made out of wood? I'm pretty sure that's Sinestro, right? It looks a little bit like Sinestro. Sinestro's a little more yellow. And a mustache. <laughs> I think he was yellow head to toe. Basically, yeah, every right. single one of these bad guys looks like a man. Ah, this is the. Oh, hey, Monk on Monk Axe. Oh, sound yellow. yellow. Yeah, it just paints uh, down. They ruined that. <laughs> you should not come home unless you bow. Oh, I forgot to bow. Rude. Yeah, it's too late. Darius is in play. Sportsmanship car was going to kick your ass, Darius. Yeah. Also, you have your power thing. Yes, I'm going to use that when I get desperate. 
one of them leaked to yellow. That was, that was, that was, that was the one that was leaked to That's the stupidest <laughs> Alan, Alan, Scott? I need to get across town really fast, Alan, Alan, but I can't. Alan, 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 the sun's out. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The sun's out. I can't call a cab. <laughs> oh, and he doesn't fall over. He just gives up. Interesting. Yeah, uh, he was only like horrible. half. He only got two of about half of his half. Like, yeah, what? he'll be back. Alice, Alice is saying. Mom, Mom bonus. Woo! Woo! So is that other guy's job, true love? <laughs> 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 Professional <laughs> true lover. Yeah. So what do you do for a living? He's like Egyptian lover. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I do tour for a living. Oh, no. oh, come on. Yeah, come on. Oh, yeah. I don't know, isn't true love what Fabio does for a living? Frustrated him. Draw a controller. Oh snap! He just walked back. Again. Oh. <laughs> Quick, throw your Pokeball. <laughs> so I feel bad making Darius like play through the entire game, but he really is kicking ass here, so. <laughs> well, part of me is wondering how much <laughs> castle there is, right? Like, <laughs> yeah, you're already in like some of vaguely interior. Are we talking like bungalow, split level ranch? Where is the princess? There she is. <laughs> <laughs> There's your princess. It's true, we haven't seen a cutscene of the princess since we switched over to <laughs> That's just her looking disappointed. <laughs> oh, oh, it's him. Yeah. Oh, it's my untrue love. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, actually, that's kind of pretty much how it is. Like each each one of these characters has a different end cutscene, and uh, she's pro progressively less satisfied. With, uh, oh, that makes I guess that makes sense. So like you get a better ending if you if you win with the first guy. <laughs> if yeah. her true love saves her, she's really happy. If the one saves her, she's satisfied. If the big guy saves her, she stays where she is. Yeah, she's like I'm good here. She's like no, I'm fine. <laughs> Me and the hawk, we're getting along great. <laughs> I told you he did kickboxing in high school. Yeah, this is, yeah, it's this is, it, it's, yeah, it's really, the skills really translate. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly. Wow. Well, like, nice hat. Guy. Yeah, the helmets are getting progressively more ridiculous. <laughs> Pretty soon you're going to have to fight, like, helmets. Carbon Miranda. Yeah, I was yeah. going to say, I really want the next one to be wearing a ton of fruit. <laughs> <laughs> it's getting a little Power Rangers up in here, I'm not going to lie. Oh. Careful. Oh, oh stupid dog. Listen. My anti hawk serum. <laughs> <laughs> the only Matt cure for hawk, hawk, hawk is flowers. No shirt. Control your stuff. No hat, but no shirt. If I just I really keep bowing, <laughs> this fight will <laughs> never happen. <laughs> oh. I really hope one's in a completely yellow jumpsuit with a black stripe inside. Oh, well, kill Bill. <laughs> the last boss is Daryl Hannah. <laughs> Oh, I see where this is going. Where's it going? He's not actually going to attack first all the time. Like an oh. idiot. Sure to have great blocking abilities, so I will constantly punch you first. Moron. <laughs> <laughs> You, 
You could have shared that, so yeah, I'll just need that. Yes. That's it. No one punches me. <laughs> <laughs> Yep. <laughs> Perhaps the best part of that is how he's. I'm like Narcissus yeah, Prince. Absolutely. The moment you touch my face, we're I just we're landing with, we're landing with the hands wail on you. Position. Actually, I really like this game because Punch Out is one of my favorite. Ge like Super Punch Out actually yeah. is one of my favorite games, and this is actually uh, kind of similar to Super Punch Out. He's got that timing. Yeah. There's less of a guess the state machine. Uh, oh. Into a little like hut and buy better armor. <laughs> <laughs> or a hat. Or a hat. Or send like some EMTs to get the true love guy back. Yeah. <laughs> he just threw him off a cliff. <laughs> yeah, I don't think he's coming back. He's, he's not coming back. back. The worst part is that the monk just watches him go. Yeah, he's just like, he's like hey, bro. Whoa. Well, also, he was like already climbing up, and so it's just that he did that in flies, like he already knew that it was just not going to go well. <laughs> Like, he's been gone for a while. The princess, the princess of Medina, what did you send? The true love guy. Yeah, I better go. Yeah. <laughs> like, I'll take a nap and then I'll uh, Did you trigger that? I did not trigger that. That's okay. That's I think that's awesome. just the iPad, possibly just oh. my iPad. Two dudes in a row. That's tough. Yeah, I've heard that. Well, he's got a mask. Is this the first one with a face mask? Maybe. Yeah, I think he is. The others had silly hats, but no, like, Yeah. I'm trying to think of what Japanese culture things they could have worked in that they didn't. Like, I want one fight that's just a boomerang puppet show. You control one puppet, they control the other puppet. Yeah. And the other puppets are beating each other up. Yeah. Although, arguably, that's all what it comes to the game. More flower juice. Alice Gate! Whoa, the door closed on the bonus. camera. <laughs> Starburst! But you didn't have to fight a boss, or yep. was that the boss? The They're clearly guys? pretty good getting close to the, to the palace here. Because now you've got three dudes. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh. Curly! Oh. Curly! Curly. <laughs> <It's TV. laughs> <laughs> wow! South Park head. Wow. I like the chains that. So you have to fight all three of them. You have to fight the Luchador. Oh. Whoa. Then I'll tell you it's the last boss. <laughs> nice, he bowed back. He only did the first time. Oh. Come on. <laughs> he only bows once. <laughs> Fine. Don't be a dick. It would be nice to have like Chop Chop Master. <laughs> <laughs> At least in the PSN version, yes. right? Yeah. I told you what happens in the, the Parappa stage of the PlayStation all day without going out, right? Oh, I saw it. I saw it. Uh, it takes place in Chop Chop Mr. Onion's um, dojo to start. But then the walls fall apart and there's a giant monster in the background. <laughs> but then Chop Chop Mr. Onion becomes a giant, like, Ultraman style guy and fights the monster in the background. Awesome. While you're fighting in front of it. That's awesome. Ow! Punch the spine. Oh, lumbar. Oh, okay, alright. He's got a little delay on that one. <laughs> Get him, Scoob! Cheap power. Cheap power. Not yet. Oh, yeah, I do have it. <laughs> it's really, it's a really terrible indicator. Yeah, it could be It goes from blue to blue. <laughs> Supposed to be like offering you boxing style tips while this goes on. You got him on the ropes, Darius. <laughs> Join the Nintendo Fun Club. <laughs> Ow. Oh. 
Hell yeah. Yay. Get that flower. Come on, bonus. <laughs> I know. Where's, where's the girl group that runs out in Saints when that happens? Oh, oh no. Hot time, hot time. Yeah, you. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. Come on, Chip. Ah. Oh, I got you. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah. Fuck you, Mom. What? Is this it's a health fight bar. now? Oh, it has a health bar now. Oh, jeez, I didn't notice that. That's awesome. I got you. I was the hawk has a tail. I down the hawk until I realized that means you're killing a hawk with some rare hands. <laughs> Actually, but that's kind of creepy. The hawk is the moron that keeps walking back into your fist. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just going to punch the air, and if you happen to fly into this it. This time for sure. To <laughs> be fair, it is a bird. <laughs> <laughs> If only I had a glass wall. <laughs> yes. <laughs> a, phone a window. A phone booth and a cardboard cut out of Tippy Hedry. Just flies right into it. Suck it. Good. Uh, Good. There's the dead body of a hawk. Come on, Defeat it. Mega points for the whole. My bonus! Man, all these bonuses. <laughs> yeah. Good job. The hawk didn't bow back either. It deserved it. So, is it the final battle? Oh. Looks like it. Yeah, yeah we did just beat the hog. <laughs> that is was this, the final battle. Is this battle. where you dress as a woman to go save the emperor? <laughs> Whoop. No. Oh, no. Henchman. Some meaningless henchman behind okay. a door. That would have been so much more awesome if you pointed at his eyes. This is the part where you have to it's be like Turbo back. Bane before you get to fight Turbo Joker, <laughs> and then you get to fight regular Joker. <laughs> <laughs> I hate this type of game. <laughs> That made me so angry. That like, wow. ruined that entire game for me. Are you helping more? Yeah, I think I'm rocking with you. Uh -huh. It was like it got kind of grimy, and then that ending was just like. This is what I wait, I played this game for. Yeah. Basically, from like once you beat Croc onward, it's just a pointless exercise. Like, it's just big boss fights for no reason. I like the sniper. Oh, there he is. Save it. Save it That's okay, I still have giant dude. That's true. Yeah, he's are, like, are we are we going for maximum disappointment for <laughs> the princess now? Perhaps. <laughs> I defeated Akuma's toughest boss twice. twice. Well then, yeah, I finished his Watch out for his air fireball. Watch out for my monk bonus. <laughs> he's like, great, I have to stand up now. <laughs> See, this is why I want. True long god just like jump kick through a wall now and like take out the monk. No, I want it monk. She's my girlfriend, god damn it. He has a lot of good points. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I think strongman's gonna have to punch this guy in the face. You should have played like, next to Now time for strong guy. Oh, he gets a story. The monk didn't get a story. Yeah, he did. The monk was, the monk was oh, creepy. Oh, that's right. He was creepy. So they all want to bang this chick. Yep. And she's like, hey, stranger on the side of the road. Why yeah. I puzzle? saw you so once. I now I'm going to murder an emperor. For me to climb cliff and fight man and then to save you. I love how he's the heavy. Oh, too, crap. Right what, was, what was True Love's backstory? Did he actually know her in some capacity? I can't even yeah. bow. Yeah. You can't tear it. Yeah, you're in fight mode, you can't bow. No, what if a four fight mode? <laughs> he has no kung fu at all. He's just like, I punch you lots of times now. <laughs> it's a fair human. Uh oh. This is not. You have your chi. Uh, yep. Uh, yeah, I'm pressing the button. 
Oh, bubbles. Careful. I'm smacking your SG. There we go. Oh. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> so he has less health now. Did he just like belly no cell that a hit? <laughs> I am thrown and full of force. Oh, nice. Uh-oh. That's actually good, I think. Yeah, each of the protagonists have a different musical accent, a uh, different musical instrument. Oh, so he's like the yeah, his is like the oboe yeah. or something. Yeah, I think Basu did that. Oh, I was hoping I could end that fight with the headbutt. Aww. Yeah, you're There we go. Nice. Oh, that was really anticlimactic. <laughs> <laughs> but it said Boston. Oh, Maybe he doesn't get a bonus. Maybe that's his problem. She's like. Yeah, she's not happy about this. Uh, Whoa. I'm not happy about this. Whoa. Wow. Yeah, this is not weird. Wow. Uh, fast. So, Whoa. Like, even in the, when you saw a development commentary at the end of the game, it's like you really tried to make this ending unsatisfying. Like, well, it, unsatisfying is not the adjective I would use. <laughs> sure. But yeah, sure. But he's oh, not he's really low shit. A suitor who will make her even happier. The, the one thing that, I, that, that we didn't get to see uh, because Darius played the game too well uh, <laughs> was that uh, if the brute goes down, uh, you can start spending points to revive him oh. uh, and that reduces your know, total score and uh, you know, Interesting. Yeah. yeah, as far as like a sustaining gameplay experience, it's a really interesting mechanic to yeah, just sort of be like, yeah, you have this like pile of... Just, I mean, <laughs> if after 30 minutes of this, if you die, would you want to start from the beginning? It's yeah. not that much of a game. You kind of want to just finish it and go, woo. Yeah. yeah. I like that they try to balance it so that you can just sit down and play through the whole thing. Yeah. I think it would be nice if it was like Zombie U, and that after the brute, you just got a progressively weirder series of villagers. <laughs> 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 like, like, guy with a stick. Yeah, you know, like the guy who's got the farming rake. The kung fu hustle guy. With the, <laughs> yeah, yeah. The old apothecary lady with the with the crazy headdress. Because he's got different zombies. Yeah. Well, zombie you when you die. Awesome. It is, it is so pretty amazing to see when, like the uh, totally uh, different attitude towards game difficulty and yeah, yeah. yeah. But when you die in zombie, you your character becomes a zombie, yeah. and then oh, nice. you play again as something. Like Matt did a good blog post about um, his attachment. I think I think a really good fun game jam concept, like just for a project, would be to like make a game where you're the hawk. And like oh, yeah. that's, that's the whole game. Like, you know, like, like how do you how do you, how do you make the hawk have interesting gameplay? You know. Yeah, I'm gonna see how yeah, there is no works. save, right? I just I just curious to see how big this 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 team turned out to be. Uh, four executive producers. Four executive producers. Yeah. Pretty big team, I'm gonna say. You know, one one lead artist, one anim uh, yeah, who is who is also the animator, one three D artist. A lot of these names. Well, the 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 yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Both of the audio guys were also producers, which I think is funny. Yeah. Well, for this game, it makes sense. Yeah. And I, I think I think everything past this point is getting to oh woodblock art. That's neat. So just 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 that one picture that you see at the beginning of the, of the <laughs> game. assistant to Jordan. Right there. <laughs> That's a a citant, excuse me. A c a is what it said. Original theme by Francis Mechner. Man, the oh, this Prague Philharmonic yeah. are like. I was right, Yuri Lowenthal was the true love! <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> he did the voices for Suck the Suck it, American Joe! Like five voice actors. Special thanks to John. Oh, okay. So. Well, I think if you're any kind of like game developer of a certain generation, you just have to write special thanks to John Blow into every game you like. Ooh, powered by Unreal. Yeah. Oh yeah, that, that that's right. Right at the beginning of the game, has you have the UDK thing comes out, uh, which is why 
originally when uh, when they were talking about this game, it was all about. Uh, I mean, I'm just going to put this on. on uh, or originally, uh, when this game was being promoted, it was all. Um, it was it assumed that it would only be on the console downloadables, uh, PS and Xbox. Like. And you know, I, I'm not quite sure how much time passed between the time they first announced it and the time when this came out. But now it's <coughs> primarily being touted as a as, as an open game. Hmm. So I guess because that's, that's really weird because that would necessitate a switch to single touch gameplay yeah. completely, right? Mm -hmm. So was it originally conceived of as a single button game on console? Because that's that, why I wonder. Yeah. That would be weird. Yeah, that's why I'm wondering yeah. how the Xbox and the PSN one play. Right. They probably give you different buttons to, but it's still. It's still one button. Really yeah, weird. I'm sure there's like one button to block and one button to. I don't, I don't know. Know. So. Really? I haven't looked, but I'm. I mean, I would imagine. I would imagine they would just map every button to action, and that would be it. <laughs> Pick your favorite button. Yep. Just head button the controller. Maybe they have. Maybe they have uh, uh, 25 different kinds of bow that you can do with different <laughs> combos. Uh, I I I will pay money for that. Yeah, this game is <laughs> primarily about expressive bowing. <laughs> I just totally want the like I want like a fake controller layout panel screen. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Every Xbox game has one where it has the picture of the controller. So yeah, yeah. It does. And there. it has a whole bunch of things mapped to every button but A that don't actually do anything, but they're things like X's, summon backup dancers, and RT is cook souffle, right? Like, and it doesn't actually do any of those things, but only the A button says mm -hmm. karate. <laughs> That's the to karate. karate. And it's the only one that actually does anything. Well, it's, it's like, like um, Explosion Man has uh, has the, the A, explode, B, explode, C, blo uh, um, X, explode, Y, explode. That's <laughs> one person in this game, explode. Um, and that's basically it. I mean, I didn't have a whole lot prepared today, but I thought it might be neat to be able to do the comparison. I actually feel that the uh, that the new Kratika is actually a lot less ambitious in terms of uh, cinematic ambition, I guess. Uh, but but you know, tries to tries to do a lot more with music, which is was always the stated goal. Um, but. Uh, I still miss the inner cutting that you get in the original game. I, I really like the. Um, kind of to a certain extent. Yeah, well, we get the cutscenes, cut but the, not the not the, not the running game. while like you know that's that you was kind of yeah, yeah the um uh, I really liked the original. I actually liked the lack of music in the original. I thought mm. it it just brought an air of minimalism to the whole thing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, you also the, don't like music in games. Yeah, I usually turn it off. But 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 also I thought it was like really yeah like it worked right. It's like it's like a it's like a Japanese themed game, and you have the um, you know this minimal aesthetic to the graphics, and then also like very little music. It's pretty much just the sound of punching. I thought that was kind of cool. Yeah. yeah, it's not that the music in the new in the uh, this version that we just played is bad. I actually enjoyed it as yeah. music, but it playing in the background the whole time just kind of contributed to this crazy feeling of Japan, ha <laughs> ha right? Yeah. Like the guys with the crazy helmets and the lacquered. Scale armor and all that other good stuff, and I'm just like, oh god, stop. It's kind of nice when the bassoon comes in because it's like that's that's not necessarily a stereotypical mm -hmm. you know Japanese instrument like mm -hmm. like the shamisen. Uh, I like that they made the characters Asian. That was oh yeah, quite a step up from original karate. From, from the blonde, well, the original karate guy, <laughs> he has white hair, so you know, it's it nice to. Have no, I. There was lots of lots of lots of facial expression in this one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> stuff was pretty. Event. Stuff was real pretty. Yeah. You know, but there was something kind of classic about um, Anderson Cooper saving Daryl Hannah in the mm -hmm. first <laughs> Karate Kai. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, also, who would pay money to see Anderson Cooper in a kung fu movie? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> And with that, I think that's, that's it. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. For that. Thanks, Jason. <laughs> If you're out there, make a game where the lady fights her way out. Or the hawk. <laughs> or, the or the hawk. hawk. <laughs> no, she fights her way out with the hawk. That's yeah. right. <laughs> I think Lady Hawk. Isn't that Mark? <laughs> 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 <laughs>